we're gonna set up some timers in stream elements. My name is Tree and I make streaming support videos. Stream smarter, not harder. And I'm also streaming, so make sure to follow me on twitch.tv slash tree. Link is down below in the description. Let's jump right into it. We're going to streamelements.com, click on our icon and go to dashboard. Here on the left, we go to chatbots and then we go to timers. As you can see, there's some new updates here. Here we can make a new timer. Timer name, we can call it whatever we want. Let's just call it test for now, because it is just a test. Keywords. Enable the timer only when the stream title contains one or more of the keywords. For example, if you're playing a game and you want to promote that game in chat, you can have that in your title, like Overwatch. And then every time that you put Overwatch in your title, it will promote this or give away. And then every time you have the word giveaway in your title, this timer will go on. You can also do that with category. So for example, we can have the category on Overwatch, Overwatch 2. And now if the category is on Overwatch 2, this timer will go on. Here we can write whatever we want. This way people can win the Overwatch coins uh, and then join, join here. And then your link. This is just something I came up with. It's not actually a link, you can actually win, okay. You can have multiple messages, so this is one message, but we can have a second one with Lucio skin here. And then uh, also just a link, I'll just just link again. And now it's gonna rotate between this one and this one. Okay, we have important settings here on the right. When do we want these timers to activate in chat? This is the online interval. So now it will go off every five minutes because that is when you're online, every five minutes it will go off. That means the first five minutes it will pick this one, second five minutes this one, so after 10 minutes, and after 15 minutes it will drop this one. With offline it's on 30 minutes right now. I don't care too much about offline, but you know, you can change this as well. And with the chat lines here, what this means is this many people have to have written in chat. It can be one person that does all these messages, by the way. So right now we put it on like 50. Now 50 messages need to be sent to your chat before it goes off, even though the five minutes have already passed. It can be one person putting 50 messages in or 50 people putting one message in. It doesn't really matter. We can also put this on one and then put this up really high and now a lot of people need to write something. Or we can put the chat lines on zero and then just the online interval will count. So now every minute it will drop one of these. Make sure to save it. After this you need to make sure to go to your Twitch chat. We're gonna go to our channel. Go to chat and then right here we can type slash mod stream elements and click on enter. Stream elements is already a mod in my channel, but it doesn't matter. Try to do this anyway. This way you make sure that your bot is definitely a moderator because otherwise you might run into certain troubles. If you want to see more stream elements tutorials, make sure to check out this playlist right here. Make sure to subscribe right here to don't miss anything. Subscribe right here for my gameplay channel because I got cool gameplay that you don't want to miss either. And if you want to grow your torch, make sure to check out out right here. I'll see you there.